And all of a sudden, I just felt my body just go, <laughs> and I swear, I'm not exaggerating. I flew. Hi guys, it's Shani T and welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new, welcome and thank you for clicking on this video. Today's video is going to be about the time I nearly drowned. I nearly lost my life. I nearly drowned. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, then stick around. So guys, let's get straight into the video. This is a story time of how I almost drowned. So it was my first girls holiday. I was 17, soon to be 18. It was my first girls holiday. I've never been on a girls holiday. I couldn't wait. I was so excited. And I thought I was a badass. I remember I booked two holidays in the space of two weeks, was it? So I went Bruh. in August for one of them. And then two weeks later, which is this story time, I went to Mallorca. So me and two friends went to Mallorca and we went there for a week and i was so excited because i like i say i'd not been on a girl's holiday before first time i went on a holiday without my parents so it was crazy that i was you know going away on my own but i was so excited and i couldn't wait and then fast forward we got there it was great and we booked an excursion to go to the water park and i could not wait I love swimming, I love water slides. I just think recently, as I don't know what it is, but as you get older, I just feel like no one really has time to be going swimming. Like, me personally, I don't. I think I just find enough time to go to the gym. And obviously because I was studying, I didn't have the extra time to be thinking about swimming. I went to the gym, I went to uni. And then on top of it, I don't like swimming because I know that the chlorine in the water damages your hair man i used to have wicked hair and because i was swimming doing swimming lessons it mashed up my hair so sometimes i just don't really feel like swimming i'm not it's not like someone's gonna say i'm gonna go swimming i think oh my god yes but you know because i was on holiday of course i'm gonna go to the water park i made sure that i had braids and whatever because you know i was going to a water park so and i was going on holiday sorry so I went about to be having my wig and going on holiday. I agree. Bruh. So anyway, went to the water park. The day came to go to the water park. We got there, so excited. We went on a couple of slides. Oh my god, amazing! And then we get onto this ride. Well, slide. Sorry. The slide. It was literally like a tunnel like literally it was like a long tunnel the best way i can describe it is it was like that and it was just long but it was like that so it was like that and it was so steep it was high i remember to get to the top we had to climb flights of stairs and i was already feeling a bit nervous because when you look over the side you're looking and you're like oh my god we are a bit high right now if anything was to happen we would be so i remember climbing the stairs thinking oh my god you know this is a bit high and we finally got to the top and there were a queue of people and i was like okay this doesn't look that bad and i'd looked and i saw that it was just like like i said it was a slight slight and it was slanted so it was literally you got on the slide and it was like you just went <laughs> and once you went down you couldn't see anything like because it was you know like all covered up so you couldn't see anything it's not like you were sliding down and you could look up and be looking at the sky or whatever no i was sliding down and i could just see white inside the slide so my friends go down i think i was the last yeah i was the last to go down the slide of course i was the last to go down the slide my two friends went down then it came to me and the mad thing about it was because it was a narrow slide 
you either had to have your hands like upright and have them up above your head because it was narrow or you had them down by your side and I think I remember the man telling me to have my hands down by my side which felt so bloody weird to me because it's like I'd lose all control you know I'd be going down so fast I didn't realize just how fast I would go down that slide oh my god I get on the slide and he goes right off you go and I think you lay there I think they give you a little nudge so you can go down so anyway I'm laying there I've got my arms down my side and all of a sudden I just felt my body just go <laughs> and I swear I'm not exaggerating I flew down that slide and I remember just thinking oh my god I remember just thinking oh my god this is fast like don't get me wrong I love fast rides there's nothing wrong but it was the fact that I had to keep my arms by my side so I remember just thinking it was just going I remember thinking in my head oh my god this is going too fast I eventually reach the bottom of this slide now what I forgot to mention to you was at the bottom of this slide it's like a plug hole literally once you've plopped out of the end of the slide you end up on this grey like circle thing and there's a tiny circle in the middle and that is the plug hole and you go round this grey thing like you are water in the sink it is the weirdest thing you feel like water in the sink and you are just going mm, and just going around it's crazy i'm thinking oh my god this is insane but i can't even react because it's happening too fast so going around going around going around going around going around, going around, going around. eventually i get to a little plug hole bit and it happened this is what i mean when i say it happens so quick I just remember plop I remember thinking plop and it happened so quick I just dropped into this lake of water there's no warning because this is what I mean when you're on the ride when you're on the slide all you see is this tall ass thing and you only see the plug part when you stood like at the top you see them go down but it doesn't look that bad so i go into the like plug hole bit and i just remember plop i just dropped into this deep ass water and i remember i just couldn't catch my breath because i was like this is insane now don't be mistaken i can swim i can swim right but when i tell you this water was deep as f I was like oh my god this i was so like thinking okay so anyway of course to get yourself back up you you know i brought myself back up restaurant whatever brought myself back up to the surface and i started swimming I started swimming and the thing is as well because i remember when i used to swim i used to wear goggles it's one of them where the water it was like in my eyes so i couldn't really see it and it was blurry I couldn't see where I had to swim to to get out of this lake. One of them where you had to climb out, honestly. So I remember just swimming, can't see. I'm like, oh my God, I can't see. I'm blind, can't see. I'm swimming, I'm swimming, I'm swimming. And I remember every time I did it, my body just kept going underwater and so did my head. I remember thinking, I'm gonna drown. I am going to drown right now. And next thing, I remember feeling this stick thing in the water and that's when it hit me I was like oh my god I just almost drowned and the bloody lifeguards had, or whatever you call them the guy that's operating the slide had to run and get that stick thing and stick it out for me so that I can grab it and he can pull me out of the water I was like oh my god how embarrassing and then when I finally looked up there was like five people just stood around looking at me looking all concerned because i just nearly drowned my two friends were there i felt so embarrassed and then i remember looking and there was like three other kids younger than me stood there looking at me 
they were probably thinking how was this girl all over nose nearly just drowned i felt embarrassed because i remember thinking these young ass kids went down this slide and just swam out there no problem and then there's me that's just nearly lost my life because i thought it was a good idea to go down this slide and thought it would be fun honestly that was traumatizing it ruined my mood it ruined my day because i was like yeah i was like i'm not going on anything else i was like you know forget art because why am i gonna go on a slide and risk my life like that again i was like if i'm gonna go on anything like that again i need to see exactly what it's like and how it's gonna be the bad thing about it was like i said the water underneath it was hidden so i didn't know at least if i'd gone in that plug bit and had known that when you drop in it's gonna be quite a large amount of water to prepare yourself type thing i'd have been like okay also i don't know i think i was just a little bit more weighty i'm not saying i was like i have their weight and whatever but you know i had a bit more meat on me i had a bit more meat on me so it was a bit harder for me to kind of swim up to the surface and stuff like that and i don't think i'd swam for years so that was the first time i went back and swam so yeah i almost drowned on holiday on my girls holiday miyoko with the girls and yeah i just almost lost my life I'm a flipping water slide in a water park in front of kids that were younger than me. <laughs> so guys, that is the end of this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you have um, ever drowned before or if it's just me that's just ever drowned in a water park on a girl's holiday in front of kids younger than me or you need to comment down below if you found it funny and you laughed at my pain that i experienced when i nearly lost my life share it i'm sure people would appreciate it and laugh at my pain and take joy out of an experience that was a life lesson for me which was to make sure that next time i do anything like that i know what's going to happen at the end of the ride slide why do i keep saying ride and subscribe if you want to see more story times about the crazy things that i've experienced in my 22 years of life and i will see you in the next video guys bye bad bitch no underwear 2020 gon pull up an egg yeah bitch i know where you can go home uber uber everywhere yeah take my bitch everywhere we be getting money every